おおPunching out some caves, we found ourselves just north of Carnarvon at a place called Point Quabba. This has an unreal area to go snorkeling. It's this wicked little bay that's protected by an island. It's got some inlet there, and the sea life, the marine life, was just phenomenal. All of us had a great time just getting used to our snorkeling gear here because it's something that we have very little experience doing and this place is absolutely perfect for getting a taste of what it's like to go snorkeling. time snorkeling at the aquarium we popped up to what I like to believe is one of those signs that you've got to have a photo with and that's where it says king waves kill and then also to right there close by is the quabba blowholes themselves so of course we had to check that out as well that you get from reception when you check in is a basic map of the area to give you a bit of an understanding of what's around you. As you can see here the weather had rolled in so we decided to take advantage of that information and went for a bit of a drive up towards Red Bluff along the coastline. One of the tracks along this drive takes you right to the coastline and it's a bit of a lookout overlooking the whole coastline and how dramatic it drops off to the sea. This is where I really found out the true meaning behind that sign of King Waves Kill. 
because these waves would be normal and then all of a sudden you'd just get this mad big set that came rolling in and as you'll see shortly, it's something that caught me by surprise. Just a little bit of waves coming in. <laughs> I'm moving back. New day dawned, but unfortunately the weather got worse and we found ourselves waking up to early morning storms right. and it absolutely right. bucketing down with rain. Ooh. uncertain whether or not we were going to make it out of uh, Cobber Station. The rain had just been settling in nicely. Come back to Carnarvon. It's time to uh, regroup, top up the tanks, clean lots of things, pull it all out. It's a filthy, filthy mess and probably we might even hit the Space Museum that's in town. Thank you. 